Final look back to Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. Uh, last time, uh, we came all the way to here. Yeah, we're in, like, the final world, final area, final whatever. And it is pretty fucking eerie. <sighs> Though I don't know what we're supposed to do. I mean, I do, kind of, but... You see, there's that in the background, so... If I hit this... Oh. Hmm. Let's hit the other one, then. Maybe that's, uh... You know, that is a solution. I was thinking maybe you would need coops to hit both of them at the same time. Uh, I guess you don't. I sure do hope there's not gonna be a frustrating platforming section at the end of this. Bonk. Okay, and this, yeah. So I'm actually gonna save before we enter the big thing in the middle. I'm not sure if it's where the boss is, or where Grotus is fucking hiding. I need to see what's over here. Huh, we could theoretically go through that. Interesting. Let's deal with this area first, though. Because remember... Fuck. Whatever. Grotus supposedly entered into here with Peach before us, somehow passing through the door. I don't know how, maybe he used, like, super paperization? That'd be my theory. Can we go underneath? No. But yeah, um... Hmm. Let's see what's in here. I should have prepared Barbary. Palace? Of... What did it say? Of the Shadow... T Palace of Shadow Tower, first floor. Oh, we can't seem to enter those. Hmm. Mario, look there. It's absolutely titanic. What in the blazes is it? Huh. I'm intrigued by this indentation here. You could put something in it. Puzzling shape, though. Huh. Definitely interesting. Maybe we need to uh, take whatever is at the end of this hallway on the right, and then, you know, utilize that. We'll see, I guess. Okay, okay, game. Come on. I am actually kind of surprised that, like... I mean, I guess I'm not too shocked that this is running at 30 FPS, because it doesn't affect the experience that much. And, uh, I think, like, maybe the lighting is using the processing power. I don't know. But for a game like this... It's fine. Oh my god, what is that? Kill it. Yay. What is that? Like, genuinely, what is that? 
or whatever it is, it does drop. Ooh, it dropped a Power Plus P badge. Holy shit. Really? We could take off, like, a Defend Plus badge and, uh, like, Power Smash or whatever. Or, like, a Close Call P and get extra partner damage. Ooh. Am I insane enough to do that? I don't know. Well, at least we got the first guy. Hmm. These guys are quite, like, very horribly mean. So yeah, I'm gonna have to try to kill them as fast as possible. You see how that only does one damage? Yeah. I need to learn how to block that attack. It doesn't let me block it. What? Like, you saw that I was hitting A. You could maybe even hear it if I was, like, mashing it loud enough and Mario did not fucking move. Another ice storm. Uh, what do I get rid of? Honestly, we have three ice storms, four ultra shrooms. Uh, yeah, sure. We can get rid of the power block because if we can, hmm, maybe that was a bad move. I don't know. I would love to have more inventory space though. So it has, uh, at least eight health. Okay, it doesn't have 16 health. That's good. Yeah, uh, that is... Okay, these enemies are getting a little bit more concerning by the moment. There's another one. Oh, there's three of you. Well, they have quite a bit of health. Seven damage. Okay, how bad are you? Huh. One on a guard. Oh my god, four on a guard! Right, you bastard. Okay, so they have maybe like 12 health. There we go. From salt. Whew, man, these guys are like absolutely relentless. I'm still thinking maybe I should have sold off the whack -a bump though, I don't know. I don't even know what that is, but goddamn, 20 HP and 20 FP. That's like... a really good deal, you know? Who are you? Oh no, not again. No one disturbed me in eons. Who dares defile the sacred place? Now who's this dragon I say is in that hook tail, the thing you beat before? Yes, 
enormous, rather with rather grimy toes. Yes, that suits this creature to a T. What? You destroyed my precious younger sister. I wondered why she hadn't written recently. Quake and fear mortals, for I am Gloomtail. I will avenge my sisters, my sister, by taking your lives and then gnawing on your bones. Yeah, uh, we're gonna have to kill this guy too. Wah, my first fresh meat in ages. Allow me to take my time and toy with you for a while. Let's use a power smash. Okay, yeah. Uh, we're gonna hurt the motherfucker's toes. That's... That's horrible breath. Jesus. Hmm. Seven on a guard! I messed it up. Shit, man. Mario's low. Oh, we heal a little. Oh, I'm not risking it, though. You could use a... Whack it, nah. We don't need the FP. Let's just use an Ultra Mushroom. We have quite a few of them. There we go. Oh, you gotta be shitting me, really? Yeah, you are tough meat, my tasty little morsels. But how will you fare against this? Not very well. I'm gonna have to switch him out this turn, but first, um... Yeah, I can't dodge that. Jesus. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, really? <laughs> yeah, baby. Full heal. Finally. Oh my god, yeah. I, f I forgot. My gambling is helping. Well, um, okay. We're gonna... I'm just gonna normal hammer, because dizzy means... There's a chance to miss. And I draw the not waste, you know, my FP. <clears throat> I'm getting good at that. Ugh, you're not the easy prey you appear to be. I would never be able to show my face again if I was bested by you a whelp, so I will show you the true extent of my power. Oh shit. Plus eight. Shit. Hold on. Gotta, we gotta think here, right? How, I need to, what I need to know are uh, uh, specifically the stats. I'm just really curious if, um, I just need to know if I can poison it to whatever. Not poison, confuse. Okay. Oh. Hmm. Okay, I can't I can't freeze it. I can use this. Tell you what, how many stopwatches do we have? 
we have several. Fuck it, let's use one. I need to see if it works. No, it doesn't work. Fifteen! Do I set my true power now? Yeah, I do. Okay, I'm gonna have to use... Like... Whatever, if we die, we have a life shroom. So that's not gonna be... As big of an issue. Oh! Okay, so... Yeah, um... Hmm. Is there really no way to, like, level up partners further? Hmm, how can this be? Yeah, okay, so I'm... Utterly horrified. Wait, if I guard, that means I should survive it? Hmm. Well... It is hoping... Never mind. Okay, we live. No, no, is it true? Can I expire? Yeah, uh... It's dead. Gee, yeah, that was scary. I had to use, like, a life shroom. Is it gonna explode now? Hold on a moment, why did Hooktail drop? A strange star-shaped stone. Hmm, I wonder where that goes. Thank god we can fully heal for 10 coins just outside of there. Also, the relatively high-level enemies here would be very nice for, you know, like, players who are underleveled. Because you can relatively, like, only- you don't really need to beat, like, one or two enemies to, you know, have the money to fully heal. So you could easily grind in this section of the game if you, like, somehow ran in at, like, a really low level, though. I don't know how you even do that. I mean, you know, I haven't been grinding for enemies at all, and I'm only, like, level 20 here. I don't know how many levels the game has, I don't know how many levels, you know, you can have, you're supposed to have here. Because, you know, in something like Pokemon, you can kind of guess that your party should be sort of similar to the, you know, gym leader's party. Here is just, like, you know, whatever. I forgot I should probably use him. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, th it is nice that it's not letting me pay 10 coins for no reason. Anyways, yeah. Okay, now that we've saved, we can go back and, like, blow up the enemy. One nice thing in- if I was making an RPG, I would just let you save at any time. Now, you know, this would allow the player to basically, you know, saves come. Uh, I mean, you couldn't save in battle, right? But outside of battle, eh, I'm fine with people saves coming, if it means they're gonna enjoy the game more. I mean, you know, granted it's not maybe the best way of doing it, but still. Okay, so what happens once we do this? Also, I'm I'm half prepared for the, for like, building to appear again, so... Okay, what happens now? Oh. Oh. Hmm. Oh, okay, I get it. Come on, Vivian, we need to blow things up. 
Let's start on the first floor and just make our way up. Also, uh, yeah, so what do we have in here? Read, feared far and wide across the land, the unseen may yet be felt, be it here, be it there. If we can see some, if we can't see something but we can feel it, then there must be something there. What? Hey, I, I get it. Hello there. Okay, I thought these were gonna be battles. So we got a tower key. You know what would be really interesting? Imagine if, like, the Thousand Year Door's curse was actually, you know, it would never be weakening. What if this entire point, what if the entire point of this was just to make us do it? Stones to rival the castle spheres. All you see isn't there, touch it to pass through. If we try touching it, we'll pass right through, so yeah. Oh, hello there. That's a cool animation. And we got another tower key. Master of Shadow, Queen of Fear, four, four stones, twin room, two are one, one is two. I think that means two rooms that look the same. The blocks in here are kind of suspicious too. Yeah, okay. What would that mean? Because it says, yeah, twin rooms. Two rooms that look the same. The blocks in here are kind of suspicious too. Well, we would need a way to destroy that block up there. And uh, we can't do that with him. Can we maybe move this one up? No. Let's read that again. Master of Shadow, Queen of Fear, four stones, twin rooms, two are one, one is two. Uh, I, I have no idea what that means. Uh... Huh. Wait, what does it say? Twin rooms. That are two rooms that look exactly the same. Well, they clearly aren't. Unless the next room... Being this one... Is the same. The seven you found by hand onward, 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 retreat, retreat. Okay, that one was easy.
I guess we can go up and uh, see what's there, I guess. Okay, what's in here? Hmm. Uh, let fall the weakest, then build to the strongest. What is this? I want to swap to Gumbella and then... No, I made the wrong move. Yeah, Gumbella is not fucking built for this. Can you tattle so I can see what the fuck that is? Dark bones. So now we'll do the best tactic. Yeah, um... What is this? They're just normal dry bones. Yeah, eight five two. And so freaky. It says from the weakest to the strongest. Right. Uh this one has the eight health. I swear to god, if I Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna really quickly switch to, um, him. Yeah. Okay, so now you. That's a red bones, I believe, yeah. Okay, so that one was so weak we just killed it. This one has five health. Okay, yeah, then it's this guy, who has 8, and then that guy, who has 20. Kind of interesting that I actually do need to blow this guy up, because apparently that's the only way you can properly kill them. Yeah, by exploding them. Yeah, uh, we'll see about your 20 health. Do we even let this guy attack us? I don't think we should. I forgot how much- yeah. Hmm. Yeah, no. We're one hit point off. And he does one damage to us. Okay, that was the correct order. And that makes a question mark block appear. But that was a really roundabout way of making the chest appear, you know? Though we do have another key, which is always nice. Okay, and, um, in the- I get it, I get it. Okay, okay, game. 
So it was a multi-room puzzle. They were just above each other. Okay. What do you say? Carrying secrets on front. Straight on, straight onward. Destroy what lies in your path. What well, this? Oh! Okay, and over here, we have... The tower key. And then, behind door number whatever... We have... Another empty room. Uh, the shy one hides their shape, the shy one hides their face. Is this a ghost thing? Okay, I wonder if you can brute force that one just by jumping around like a maniac. Yeah, we only have two left. I'm gonna switch to speed for this one. Yeah, so we basically just need to go down to the lower one to get the thing. Then we have to go back to the upper one. Then I'm gonna run out and save because we need to run out and save. And you know, then we can go up and see what horrors we have created. Hmm. Though it would be an interesting idea that you are trying to summon, you know, the ancient dis super destructive horror before any, you know, before anyone else can. Because if, you know, any, you know, ah, you'll blow it up. Question mark. But the enemy, oh, the enemy will use it for nefarious purposes. Ooh la la, is that a chest? And we have every single key. Let's go save, because I am fucking horrified of something bad happening. Granted, when I saw Gloomtail, I was, uh, afraid. I am genuinely horrified of how much health the final boss in this game will have. Because, like... You know, the final boss... Hmm... So, googling it while I'm playing, I know, maybe kills a bit of the fun, but... Okay, so the final boss should have around... So, like, not the final boss, right? But, uh, Gloomtail had 80 health? And, uh... Hmm... So that's concerning. Anyways, yeah, let's see what happens once we, uh... ...do that. Let's activate the thingamabob, and, um... I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Start a new apocalypse, the entire world is destroyed by an evil shadow demon. It's a whole lot, you know, but... I mean, realistically... Eh. Okay, so we're gonna switch to Vivian. Because I have a feeling that we're gonna have an encounter. You know, it just feels right. Like, Vivian has been called a traitor. Like, sure, right? But she hasn't had, like, the encounter with her sisters yet. And Beldum has been trying to scheme unsuccessfully with, you know, dupless and shit. 
So maybe we'll have some closure on that before the game ends. I don't know, maybe after. The stars up, the stars up in the heavens shone, carrying the lore of the sky, carrying secrets on, from on high. By skill and might engraved in stone, stones to rival the celestial spheres, the seven hewn by a fell hand, feared far and wide across the land, master of shadow, queen of fear. Hmm. Oh, what is that? Oh, it's moving. It is. Huh, what? Huh. Horrifying. What was that? Uh, I don't know, I'm wondering the same thing. Okay, yeah, I am mildly horrified of what just happened, maybe. So that is opening up, like, another area, because I was thinking this would open, like, a secret passage somewhere, but I didn't expect the area to be below the area where we just, like, snapped Gloomtail's head in half, but... Eh, so be it. Yeah, anyways, uh... I'll see you next time. There's definitely, um... A worrying feeling in the air. But that's all fine. See you next time. Goodbye.